Hello, SU Fandom! Welcome back. And you're probably wondering, what is this? Well, let me tell you, it's my thoughts on what's gonna happen with Jasper. Now, as we all know, Jasper is currently fused with Lapis Lazuli to form Malachite. And from the Barmate's teaser that we got about... Was it Tuesday or Wednesday? I don't remember the episodes by name. I remember the days that the episode premiered. It was somewhere like mid-start week of Stephen Baum 4. A teaser trailer was leaked... Let's see, um, right, a teaser trailer for Barnmates was leaked, showing Peridot presenting a gift to Lapis Lazuli, with a big old smile across her face. Now, what does this mean? Well, at some point, Lapis and Jasper defuse. How that happens is still yet to be seen. Hopefully we'll find out in some time in the near future. However, my theory is that when this happens, there's a lot of people saying that maybe Jasper will turn to the side of the Crystal Gems. I don't think that's ever going to happen. I think she would rather get crushed and shattered into a million pieces and shattered before she ever did something like that. She strikes me as, her character strikes me as way too much of a loyal soldier. Someone on the level of Black Ops loyalty. Someone who would rather die and make sure the mission is completed than fail and betray uh, their home nation and divulge valuable secrets. That's counterintelligence 101. If you're caught, you die. Regardless, anyone who knows anything about counterintelligence can tell you that. And considering she fought in the rebellion against Rose, we can only assume that there are countless, innumerable number of secrets that she herself hides that she knows about Homeworld. That if the Crystal Gems ever got to that kind of information, well, it could be very detrimental to the health of everyone involved. What I'm a little curious about is the ship they came in. Why a hand? It seems a little off the wall, if you ask me. Perhaps it was like a big joke, the hand of God coming down type of deal. Which would be funny if that was the case. And also, a shout out to everyone who liked the Stephen Bomb 5 teaser that I did. Almost 300 friggin' views now. 281 as of recording this. And man, you guys are just killing it. Left and right. Oh my god, you people are insane. I love you. Uh, sorry if I seem so tired. I'm still waking up. I haven't even put my freaking hair up. But yeah. So, that's my thoughts on what's going to happen with Jasper. She would rather be bubbled or shattered before ever joining the Crystal Gem. She just, her character just strikes me as too much of a loyal soldier. Someone who has... No redeemable qualities whatsoever. Not like Peridot, who initially is not all that interested, and we see her character development to become a... I have to use the clip right about here. A crystal gem! <laughs> go on, go on, go on. Because... 
she's actually learned to appreciate life, at least to some extent. And the fact that she got turned into shipping trash was absolutely hilarious. By far. One of the best episodes was Log Day 7142. Because... Because shipping trash is funny. That... I swear, the writers are on point knowing their fandom. Because they... It's like they took a page straight out of reality with every fandom about anime ever. With shipping trash. Which... I know I've said that way too much at this point, and it's just too friggin' funny. But yeah, let me know what you think Jasper's gonna happen, or what's gonna happen to Jasper in the comments below. And hopefully, I shall see you next time. Until then, peace out. Please, if you would, head over to Dio D Sun Hondo's channel. He does amazing artwork check out the video subscribe to mine and his channel because they're absolutely friggin amazing for different reasons and hopefully you have a great day see you next time